Chi. <laughs> Chi. <laughs> Chi. 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 Take the shirt off and we want. Well, so today we went to church, and this church is actually an hour and 15 minutes away from me, so it's it's a lengthy ride, but I have to say, it has been a great experience. I have been looking for a church that had um, a place for the kids to go where I could go to my church service and be able to really connect and that happened because I bawled during the um, opening song and it was it was kind of like I don't know I let myself go I really let it sink in what was being said I closed my eyes during prayer and really just listened to the prayer at the end and it was awesome the kids got to go into their own separate little rooms where they could play with other kids and Seth got to go upstairs to his very own church service for kids. That is amazing. I am so happy I um, was able to find this place. Um, it was a big step for me because of my anxiety. I really, really get uncomfortable, but um, I learned to really cope with my anxiety a little bit better than I used to, but, um, I still, I still have a hard time making direct eye contact with people when I'm talking, even if I know them a little bit, and, uh, yeah, so, I don't know, it was, it's just amazing, and I am so excited for next Sunday. I really am very, very excited for next Sunday. Um, not that I want the weekend to be here already because then my husband's not home, but there's a lot going on this week. Um, Corbin turns two on the 30th. Oh my God. Not, oh my goodness. I, 
I cannot believe that he turns two very soon. And then this one will be born in December. Like, I'm hoping the first or second week in December. Um, I really think that I'm getting emotional talking about the church service because... I really think it was something that I honestly really, really needed, and I'm I'm happy I went. I'm really happy that I wasn't like, eh, it's too much work getting three kids ready that early, but really, it wasn't. It was awesome, and at the end of the service, to see that when I went and picked my son, my youngest, Corbin, up from the room that he was playing with the little kids in, the smile on his face. And then McKenna said she had a ton of fun and there was no meltdowns, nothing. And then Seth asked me, can we do this more often? It was amazing. Let's be real. It really was amazing. And I don't see myself, or I didn't before, see myself as a churchgoer, but I always wanted to be because I lost connection with him, I guess, a long time ago um and he has recently i think been telling me that i need to reconnect because a lot of things have been kind of spiraling out of control lately and um just financially emotionally spiritually you know i i've lost a lot of I don't know. I lost trust in him a long time ago when he took my brother away from me at a very young age. And I now know that <clears throat> I, it's a time of need. I really, really need him right now. And I think that is why I got emotional during the opening song because it was saying, you know, telling him that I need him. I need him to help me through and help me figure out what I need to do with everything that's been going um, wrong. My health currently is a lot better than it was after I had my emergency surgery, so that's one thing that, you know, is a plus about it. <clears throat> but there are still other things that are not good. I mean, it's not horrible. People have it worse than I do, but... I used to have such a good life, and <clears throat> again, like, I'm not saying that my life sucks, but I used to have <clears throat> a good life where I didn't have to think about money, I didn't have to think about, you know, this and that, and, and just random little thing, life, and now I feel like that's all I do is stress, stress about everything, so that church service really was a time for me to let go and be real with myself and it was it really was nice anyway <clears throat> I start school soon I'm having another origami open house right now and I've had no luck with that so far nobody's came but I really haven't advertised it I mean I got a sign out by the road and I posted it on Facebook but this also shows me who my true supporters are, and right now it's just my mom and my sister. <laughs> so, I'm really looking to make a go out of this, and I'm hoping that he can help me with that as well. Um, as well as my photography business. That's doing pretty well. Uh, but come winter time, I mean, it's obviously going to slow down because I don't have a studio. But my mom is more than happy to let me use the basement area of their house to set up a small studio. So, yeah. But I think that's pretty much it for today. I just want to let you guys know how amazing that church service was. So, I wish I would have been able to vlog a little bit of it. But, I don't know, pulling out my camera on church or... Even before I got there, it's just kind of weird. But I will talk to you guys soon.